This world shall know pain. Yo guys, it's your homie Zeno Payne. I'd like to welcome y'all to one of the Black Desert Online video for the Xbox One and PS4. Today, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get your fishing level up for all those new players out there that have been hearing around the forums and the chat room that, oh, I've been making 45, 65 mil in like an hour per fishing trip. Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to level up fast so that way you guys can make up that money because it's a lot of work to in order to make that money to sell to the imperial tradesmen so just follow this video to the t and you guys will be hot spot fishing and making that money in no time now for ps4 players your hot spots are not available currently but it is good to go ahead and get your fishing up right now so that way when hot spots do drop you are one of the very few people that have a high enough fishing level to hot spot fish and make that money and get ahead of the game so let's go ahead and bounce into the video all right guys so first up we have rods now the two best rods in the game in my opinion and a lot of other people's opinions the only rods you're going to need is a triple float fishing rod which will come out later for you guys on the ps4 and it's out right now and you guys can do a quest on that i'll go ahead and put a card up above on how to go ahead and do that you must be skilled one in order to activate that quest and the bellinos fishing rod now, the Bellinos Fishing Rod you guys can go ahead and get from the Central Market as easy as going into Life Tools and then going into Fishing Tools. Now, Golden Fishing Rod, Booty, Maple Float, Booty, Medaya Fishing Rod, Booty, Calpheon Fishing Rod, Booty, Ash Tree Float, Maple Float Thingy Majigger that you put in the water along with your Fishing Rod, Booty, your Fury, your Fishing Rod, booty do not buy any of these fishing rods they're worthless they say durability up blah 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 bellinos fishing rod does the same thing as you guys level it up it will the durability will go up maxing out at 100 durability and also gives gives you an auto fishing time negative 10 percent as you guys are going to be afk fishing in order to get your levels up i recommend buying the bellinos fishing rod and now the reason why maple floats and the ash tree floats the reason why they suck and the reason why they're irrelevant is because once you guys do have hot spots on the ps4 and once you guys do get to hot spotting on the xbox one there's just no point in having those floats because you guys will just be catching goldfish no matter what and you guys will be making that money now so buy the bellinos fishing rod and then triple float fishing rods as soon as you guys can now if you guys don't want to spend that money which they're pretty cheap and they're going to be pretty cheap on the ps4 once somebody figures out how to make them whenever that is i haven't um, bought it yet for the ps4 i'm waiting for the ten dollar version to come out so but you guys can go ahead and make these fishing rods as well and all you guys need is ash timber times one steel times two pure copper crystal times five monks branch times nine and black stone powder times 15. now for those of you who are like well where do i go to craft said fishing rods go ahead and go down here if you guys are do doing the story it will lead you here eventually go into gilsh or glish gilsh however you want to pronunciate it press a on it and then go to manage crafting now, I believe it's Gilsh 1, Room 3. Yeah, you want to go into Gilsh 1, Room 3, and buy the Tool Workshop and level it up to Level 3. And you guys will be able to craft the Calpheon, Medaya, Bellinos, Euphoria, and Golden Fishing Rods. I recommend sticking with making Bellinos Fishing Rods, as those are the ones that people want to buy. All the other ones, like I said, are irrelevant and booty. So make a bunch of those and you guys can make a passive income with Balanos fishing rods. And if you guys are curious in how workers work, I do have a worker's guide. I'll go ahead and put that up in a card up above during the video. Now that we've got done with fishing rods, we need a piece of armor. Now this piece of armor can be obtained. You can either make it by getting a costume mill or go into the cm and hopefully somebody's selling it on the ps4 and people will be selling it on the xbox you guys want silver embroidered fisher's clothes now what you guys want is at least plus two plus one's fine so at least plus one at most plus three now you guys can go to make these yourselves by smashing two together to get it to plus one plus two so on and so forth now they will break and disappear from your inventory if the failing does dissipate if you guys are trying to plus one i recommend 15 stacks if you guys are trying to plus two i do recommend 30 stacks at most 
25 stacks at least and then for 30 stacks i recommend 40 45 stacks for plus three make sure you guys do have a backup fishing clothes before you guys do smash clothes together because like i said they do disappear and that will suck and the reason why you guys want this at least at plus one is because that plus one gives you fishing experience plus 10 percent as base does not give you any experience whatsoever and the reason why you guys want at least plus two or you know in, in between plus three and one is because of the fishing ability plus two level moving speed plus two level and the fishing experience plus 15 percent now once you guys have the silver embroidered fisher clothes and the bellinose fishing rod you guys are going to want to go into world map and either have a rowboat or a fishing boat i highly suggest getting a fishing boat which you guys can also get from the central market and or you guys can make by yourselves and to, in order to get it from the <coughs> central market is going to ship registration and this is the boat that you guys want the fishing boat now that you guys have your boat and or rowboat row your butt all the way over here to lima island and this is completely north of velia so velia is right here and this up here is lima island all this is the Knox sea up here and the, the reason why you want to be in the Knox sea is because you guys catch nothing but bluefish now leveling up is determined or how fast you level up is determined by how many bluefish and goldfish you catch now with the uh white items such as seaweed and fish hooks and stuff like that you're not going to gain very much exp now for green fish you'll gain quite a bit blue fish you'll gain even more and goldfish will be the most exp you can get so the higher the grade the fish you pull in the better the experience will be when you guys um and when you guys are leveling up so and the reason why we come up to knock C is because it drops nothing but blue fish with the occasional green but it's very rare and it does have the occasional goldfish which is also very rare and is dope which means that you guys will level up faster so you guys want to equip that come all the way out here to lima island and start afk fishing from beginner one and yes bellinose rod can be equipped at beginner one and then once you guys hit skilled one or more you guys are going to want to continue to afk fish here when you guys um are off the game i am master five so i'm just i don't know, even know why i even showed you that but yeah master five um and once you guys hit skilled one you guys are going to want to start your uh, hotspot fishing and my hotspot route is beginning at velia and if you guys are skilled one i recommend velia and then the route going from velia to here all the way through port euphoria over these islands around and then back to velia if you guys are skilled one now if you guys are artisan or higher the best route in my opinion that's the route that i do that where i make 65 mil or so every trip when i sell to the imperial tradesman is this way i go from belia to the right all the way out to the arsha sea a little close to the desert for ps4 it's only going to be as far as it lets you because you guys obviously are not going to have the desert uh available to you currently or at least for not for a while and then back over here towards lima island and then back down to Velia. that's my routes for both skilled one and artisan uh, up and above or below now guys i hope you guys get out there and start leveling up that fishing especially for you guys on the ps4 so that way when hotspots do drop on the ps4 you guys can start making that money other than that guys if you guys found this video informative don't forget to smash that like button and if you guys want more black desert online content for the xbox one and ps4 don't forget to subscribe. Your homie Zeno Payne out. Peace.